Jan refused this courtesy to Raul. This made his evaluations pretty difficult. Raul managed to communicate to us that due to some recent cuts in his hours, he would be forced to get a second job to pay the bills. Something about this absolutely set Jan off. She told him that she would fire him if he dared. I could see plainly on the intake paperwork in front of me that Raul had been hired with the understanding that it would be a full-time position. So I pointed that out. Jan was furious, but agreed through gritted teeth that if Raul agreed not to get a second job, she would bump his hours to at least 35 hours a week. It was stated as clear as day and I documented it in my daily manager logbook. Work went on as usual after that and I didn't think much of this meeting again for a few months. Another time, a while later, while filing out information for my tax returns, Jan called me into the office. I could tell she had pulled the tiny room apart looking for something. All of the information about our Puerto Rican employees is gone!